We got some Ram 7 no recoil class coming up. This gun with this attachments, these attachments, deems actually quite hard. And I'm actually really happy about this because I feel like the Ram 7 is a beast no matter what. And able to like change the attachments a bit and make it beam a little harder than already what it, it does. It's it's just a phenomenal thing. Um, and on top of it, man, it's still very strong. Still aims in pr pretty quickly. And you're still able to beam kids. So, I mean, that's just the best of both worlds. Am I right? These guys keep throwing nades at me, man. Keep throwing nades at me, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm choking. Oh, no. I'm choking. I'm flanking them. Stay up. I'm flanking them. They're all here. Why are they all here? What the? This thing is just a freaking beast. Got smokes. What am I playing? Uh, team scrim? I just choke shots there. I can't blame the gun there. That was on me, man. So, brick some shots. Jump shot around the corner real quick. Pop this VTOL on the point. And this is like... Bro, the Ram 7 is easily my favorite AR right now. I like a lot of guns. I do like the M4. But if you ask me to choose the M4 or the M5, I would easily choose the M4, man. Because this gun... I mean, the Ram 4, what did I say? I would easily choose the Ram 7. Because this gun is just a freaking tank, dude. These guys are all... Dude, I'm so... How do I approach this? Got up. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. This thing is nuts, bro. Bro, like pure good damage, good range. Like e everything you want from Ram 7. Like this class is so good close up. And basically, with these attachments, all I'm doing is basically allow it to beam a little harder than what it can already do. You know what I mean? So it's phenomenal, man. I'm actually kind of scared of challenge now. This guy's definitely preaming me. Jesus Christ. And I almost got shot in the back, too. That would have been bad. I'm still hurt, though. And they could spawn behind me. Dude, stop throwing nades, man. Stop it. Stop it. Can teammates, can you assist me right now? Oh, no. I'm, I'm, oh, no. I'm dead. I was working on a nuke, dude. And I feel like the Ram 7 doesn't get looked at as much. And it's honestly, in my opinion, of easily a top gun. Easily... A very very good gun and i'm surprised that it doesn't get looked out as much i don't know if it's because it's a dlc weapon and you do have to eventually unlock it to use it like even then like i understand i understand that part like i really do understand that part but if you hear about it if you know about it like i feel like you would eventually make the effort to try to get it there's still got this table here okay let's go real quick so i do use tack laser on this gun here's why tack laser really has no cons and increases the ads the thing about the Ram 7, I'll, I always say this, and I feel like one of its biggest weakness is that the ADS is kind of slow, and it's not like the fastest ADS gun. And I feel like they did a good job with that because if they just allowed it to ADS quick, well, I mean, this thing would be ridiculous. This is a radar, and this guy is kind of oblivious, but I don't think he knows that spot. Could be a little newbie. Move out my way, man! Oh, man, I could have got so many kills. They're all up there, dude. I'm so... No, I thought to the side because my teammate wouldn't move out my way. So uh, I do put the tack laser on. Look at dumb beams, man. Like, I'm not even gassing it, bro. Like, I just mapped that guy in the window. I don't think I missed the bullet. And I just hit really good shots. And yes, I do have a good shot. I'm not, I'm not discrediting that, nor am I trying to gas myself. But I do have a good shot. So that is part of it. But this gun's recoil is just with all these attachments. It's just so easy to recontrol. And it basically has... It's not 100% no recoil, but it's pretty, pretty almost very close to no recoil. Oh, no, I ran out of ammo. I ran out of ammo. He's dead either way. Gonna, gonna show you guys. Uh, let's see if I can get into the far. Okay, this guy's on our side. Oh, my God. Oh. Again and again and again. Yes, I know. I keep beaming you, man. What do you want me to do about it? Look at that, guys. Like, I'm not even trying to gas the gun up, but... Like, you see what... You see him? Seen that? Very close to this VTOL. Uh, not VTOL. Very close to this, um... Advanced UAV. I do want to get this bad boy as well, man. And I just want to say... I know, like, we're in the middle of a video. But I just want to say, man, I seriously appreciate all the love and all my videos and stream. If you guys have been part of my streams, man, the streams have been nuts lately. And I just appreciate all the support. And if you've been, like, subbing to my videos, liking as well. Just showing love. It means a lot to me, man. So I just want to say big shout out again. Thank you, all you beautiful people for everything, man. And right now, we're so close to an advanced UAV. And I have no idea where they're spawning. 
Okay, well. Oh my god, I almost choked that. I almost choked that. I'm so scared of challenge. I don't know why I'm scared. When I have a when I have a a thing that doesn't even move. I have a gun that pretty much barely moves. I could literally take almost any 1v1 gunfight and come out victorious. It, it like it doesn't move and it just kills fast. It's a double Is this guy sitting all the way back here? Alright. Well, I'll take that. Oh my god. I love advanced UAVs, man. Advanced UAVs are freaking amazing. Oh my god, he almost killed me. Oh my god, I'm, I need help. I need help. I actually need help. Thank god he didn't see me. This guy's gonna come up here. I'm shooketh. Dude, can one of my teammates get me like an advanced UAV? Imagine. Bro, if you guys if you could double your advanced UAV, you'd get you'd get so many nukes. Like if you were playing with someone and they help you get advanced UAV, it would be ridiculous. Of course you're there. That's like easy read. Pretty much spot everyone goes to. I don't know what's my streak right now. Is it like 16, 17 maybe? It has to be more than that, right? It's probably close to 20 now. Now I'm just scared to move around the map. Oh my god, that's how I died. But Loki, did you just not see me beam that guy across the map very quickly, dude? I'm telling you, man. And I love the Ram 7. I love this so much that I used it a lot. Like, I used it a lot when it first came out. I was using it a nonstop. Look at this beast, man. Oh my god, you're just such a good gun, man. And I used it a lot to the point where I used it so much that I got tired of it. And it's not I even I didn't even really get that tired of it. It was more so that I was just like I wanted to get like content and gameplay with other guns that I just kind of like I was like, all right, bro, I really got like I'm having fun with this gun, but I just gotta stop using it, bro. If not, like I'm never gonna get gameplays with other guns, you know? And then uh yeah, kind of uh just wanted to keep using it. I noticed that earlier. I I noticed Oh my god, dude, they just all flooded me there. Become one with the Ram 7, because this is a gun that you will actually be like, damn, I made a right decision. And people who've actually used the Ram 7 have come to my stream and be like, yo, Apathy, this Ram 7 is nice. Or, yo, Apathy, like, this gun is actually really good. And they will argue with me, like, it's even better than M4. And M4, in my opinion, it's slightly better than the Ram 7. But the M4 is, like, it used to be the best gun. It got nerfed a lot of times. I think it's the second best gun right now. I think the MP5 is definitely better than it. It's not by a huge margin. Very, very little. But I do think it's better than it. And you're just going to shock me in the back now, are you? So you know when people are saying the Ram 7 is better than the M4. That like this gun is really good. Like that's when you know it's like shit, bro. They're right. Like this gun is actually really good. And I'm just spawn killing all these guys here. that are spawning on me. Holy oh, shit. Look at that kill feed, bro. What the f dude? That kill feed. I literally just lit up the whole kill feed, bro. We gotta drop a like for that kill feed, guys. So the only one thing. Oh my! Look at that, man. No recoil. Ram Seven just freaking tearing it up, man. So the one thing I will say about the no recoil, obviously. Oh my god. Oh, I'm grabbing. Damn it! The one thing I will say about the Ram Seven no recoil is obviously the simple fact that. I mean, when you lower the recoil, ADS usually does take a little bit of a hit, so it's gonna aim in a little slower. Yeah, I want to, I want to kill this guy. Oh my god, dude, dude, I'm um, five bullets. No, need more. Dude, we gotta get the next hill. Dude, I'm in pace for 100 kills on Azir Cave. Wow, joining mid game. I didn't even join. We gotta cap the hill though. Oh my god, dude. I'm on 88, and I, I joined. I'm pretty sure I started this game a little late. I didn't even join it at the start, and I'm I'm li I'm literally so close to dropping 100 kills. Damn, what could have been? 88 kills, man. You guys got anything to say on the other team? Anything, guys? Ten deaths. Almost dropped the nuke. All right, guys. So this is the Ram 7 class I was rocking with. Compensator Commando, the best low recoil attachments you can rock with. So it's a very, very good combo. 
I was rocking the XRK Ranger. Damage range, bullet velocity, recoil control, another great attachment. Obviously, more damage range is awesome. I was rocking tack laser just for that quick ADS uh boost. And there's no really cons other than you can obviously you can, once you're aimed in, they'll see it. But it gives you uh, on top of it aiming stability, aim walking steadiness, a little extra stuff, and rubberized grip tape for that recoil control. And the only con is aiming stability, which is not a big deal. I don't lose ADS speed or anything with this one. So this is a very good class of like I said. This beams like crazy, very to low to no recoil. And this gun is just amazing. It shreds. So this is just phenomenal. I really hope you guys just enjoyed today's video. Make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, everybody. Much love and much respect.